Uh, good morning, good afternoon, or good evening, boys and girls. Turn of voices is the DOUG here, and it's time for the PlayStation Plus games of August 2024. Which is a mixed bag this time around. You know, I kind of like the this past month, but August is kind of meh. Um, let's start with the games. We got the three. The first two will be both on PS4 and PS5. The last one is on PS4. The first one is Lego Star Wars The Skywalker Saga. You pretty much, to get the Platinum, you have to play all nine movies, pretty much. Complete all of them. Complete it. Get all the collectibles. 100% everything. Difficulty wise, it's a 4 out of 10. You pretty much have to do two runs, play in the game normally, and then go back through every stage once you have all the characters you need and free roam. It would take you about 100 hours. Um, like with most LEGO games... They're, they're all fun, but it kind of gets repetitive after a while, and it platinums can be very time-consuming. Second one is a game you just saw on this channel get finished not too long ago. Five Nights at Freddy's Security Breach. It's a 3 out of 10 difficulty, run one, takes you about 20 hours. But remember, the game is buggy, so if you try to go for the platinum, just know it will be buggy. There will be a lot of buggy issues, but the platinum is doable. It's just very time-consuming and hard. It is still an ultra real platinum. And then the last one, Enderline's Quartus of the Knights. Um, it's kind of like a Metroidvania style game. Um, so that does look appealing. Um, it would only take you 25 hours and you can do everything and run, run. But it is a 7 out of 10 difficulty because it is a little bit of an unforgiving game. Um, the AI, the AI can, is, can be a bitch and all that. So be one. That would be a tough game. But... It is a fun game. Um, I personally have played Lego Star Wars. I did, that game was fun, but it's one of those that you have to really put... Because i got to go back and finish it myself at some point, but it's one of those that it is time-consuming to get the Platinum. Because you really have to dedicate a lot of time to it. And when you've got enough backlogs as it is, you don't really get to do that. Trust me, i got a lot of games i got to reinstall to get the Platinum or start actually playing. Um... But what do I give the month? Well, it's not a bad month, but it's not a great month. Um, it's kind of like middle of the road, you know. So I'm going to give it a C. It's not bad, not great, average. You know, like I, I do own two of the games already, but Lego Star Wars, the Sky Wars Saga is a fun game if you love Star Wars or the Lego games. Um, Five Nights Security, Security Breach can be fun, but it is very buggy. Um... And all that, plus, yeah, we saw how much I raised with all the bugs. And then the last one, the night one, I have never played, so I can't give judgment on that one. But looking at the trophy list, it does look like it would be a little bit of a fun, difficult time. Anyway, let me know what you think of the Plus games in the comment section below. Do you, are you happy with it? Are you upset? Let me know. Until uh, later tonight when I stream uh, WrestleQuest, most likely. Um... This is the DOUG signing off saying thank you for watching and I'll see you guys later tonight for WrestleQuest. Uh, Friday will be college football uh, where I coach my mom's mail and tuppence.